Hey guys, it's nice catching up with you today. How's everything going? Oh, we're doing great. What's going on? Okay, awesome, awesome. Well, I wanted to touch base with you guys today. Um, I don't know, a few months ago, maybe six months ago. I can't even remember when I ran across your profile and your music, but um, I liked your style. So, started following you. Um, and I don't, I don't know a whole lot about you, and I know that you had told me at one point that you guys have a little bit of non-country rap background. So can you tell us about that? Yeah, we, uh, so we both started off, uh, in regular country music, not, not so much in the traditional sense, but, you know, we were both kind of, uh, <clears throat> original artists. Yeah, orig original, original country artists that, you know, we did kind of our own mix of, country and rock and pop there was never any boundaries i think that's a brian has no boundaries <laughs> so so you guys were together uh as a group even when you were doing that kind of music no nope, we were two different two different projects brian would hit me up when he was up in this area and i'd come open up for him and we built a pretty cool relationship on the writing standpoint and uh personality i mean we just kicked it off became really good friends and i felt like i'd go to go to war with the guy so why not you uh, are in war the country rap yeah. war that's what you're yeah, in right yeah. now virtual <laughs> genres out right now that's what i hear i guess i don't really know that as a for a fact but that's what i hear and we're having a good time doing it and uh it's so unique and fun and so the first song that you guys put out was that one country roads Yep. Yeah, it was First Patrice. Okay. And so you guys wrote that one together, or how did that happen? Yeah, we wrote we wrote that one together with uh, we so when we got together and so this was kind of an idea for a while, and so we were both kind of picking away at figuring out how with the sound that we wanted, and and once we honed in on it, Country Roads came out. So, um, so you've got you've had that song out, and then the second song. Pleasant Grove was Yes, the Pleasant Grove. So that one came out. Um, and then the next one that we should see, is that going to be Demon? Yeah, that'll be uh, Let It Bang, Demon Jones featuring Lonka. What else is going on? I mean, where do you see you guys in the next uh, six months moving forward? Well, we put together a pretty good strategy um, after the release of Let It Bang. And... Uh, we're going to be releasing a single every week. We're unique individuals. Let's do something unique. You know, let's mm -hmm. just develop a unique strategy here to get our name and these songs out and, and keep people hungry for it. We're, we're confident in our music. You know, we're confident in these in these songs. And so hitting them, hitting the fans with a hot single every week, uh, that's what we're going to be doing for 16 weeks straight. So we definitely have a, a huge game plan. Is that the 20th uh, of this month or next month? Yeah, this this month right here, October 20th. Uh, so over soon. Really at the Moxie Theater. Yep, so, so Let It Bang drops on Friday. And then the following Friday, Deer Killer drops. And that's just a straight long cut song. Um, okay. And so for the next 16 Fridays in a row, four, four straight months, you'll get a song every Friday. Well, that's... And those songs are being produced by uh, Ty out of Burn County in Oregon. 